Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, welcome back to the live stream lessons. Uh, thanks for tuning in today. Um, yeah, so I went on vacation for a couple of weeks down in Mexico and I came back and then I got sick. So yeah, sorry for the, the long pause. So um, let's get started today. Um, hopefully the summer is going good for y'all the summer vacation um and well let's get working so today we're gonna be working on um the happy farmer from uh suzuki book number one so first let's listen to how the piece goes all right mistake at the end there but we'll take a look at it all right so kind of a quick piece but it's not too difficult all right so a couple of things first let's just talk about the pickup note here remember that the pickup note we have to imagine there's a, a, a imaginary uh, measure right here right uh is it showing up no sorry so right here in the very beginning that g will be on the end of the fourth beat of that imaginary measure so it'll be like one and if we count the measure out loud it'll be like one and two and three and four one like that so just keep that in mind. Second thing is the dotted um, dotted quarter rhythm. So dotted quarter uh, and then with the eighth note. So one. Remember that dotted quarter notes equal to three eighth notes. So we have to count one and two like that. So one and two and three and four and so i i like to think like one two three four uh so i i count in groups of four eighth notes right so one two three four one two three four one one two three like that so if first get used to that and then start counting out loud with the beats so one and two and three and four and like that so those are the two main things that you should uh, focus on the rhythm and i'll probably make a video about the dotted rhythm soon so keep that keep uh an eye out for that as well so um also another big thing about uh this song is we're going to continue using our second finger on the D and the A string. So remember that we're going to be playing second finger for the F natural here. And then as well as the C at the top, right? So let's just try play, playing the first line together 
um, kind of slow just to get used to it right all right one and two and three and four one and two one and two Kind of tricky this guy but I'm sure you um, got it but let's talk about a couple of things so uh, on the dotted quarter rhythms what I what would like you to do uh, with the bow is play uh, leave a space in between the two notes so one and stop the bow so one, stop and then set your bow and then go again, right? So we're doing double down and then double up. So one, let's try it slowly. One and stop, down, up now. One and stop, up again. So that's how we do double down bow and double up bow. So try to stop the bow in between the notes, okay? So let's try that one more time slowly. The very beginning um, phrase, without the without the pickup, just starting from the C. So one and stop. One and stop. And then keep on going. Like that. Excellent. And the this part. practice it slowly and it's kind of confusing with the the finger pattern right there's a lot of repeating things it's it's kind of like a tongue twister for your fingers right so let's just try playing these two lines together um, and let's play it at the the slow speed again and remember to uh, stop the bow in between the double down bows and double up bows okay all right let's try so with the imaginary measure, one and two and three and four. And stop. One and stop. One and stop. look at the next phrase uh, let's find it uh, where's the mouth there you go sorry there we go so just remember that there's a pickup note of a G so um, try to think of this next part, this next to the top, the top um, two measures. It's kind of just like a scale going down, right? So starting from F, one and two, and one and two. And then we go back to G. And then we do a full scale down. So F, E, D, C. 
then the next line, the second line of this phrase, uh, it's basically the same thing as the beginning, only we end on like that. So the only difference is the ending here. Let's just try um, this phrase um, the first time through, right? Because this phrase repeats itself. Uh, let's just try it very slowly. Um, the same things apply uh, in the double down bows and the double up bows. Try and stop the bow. I'll yell stop. Um, and yeah, let's just try it. So remember, there is a pickup of a G on the very last eighth note. So I'm going to count the imaginary measure out loud and, and we'll, come in on the, we'll come in on the end of four. All right. Ready? One and two and three and four. And stop. One and stop. the the this phrase once again because it repeats right so let's just try the to re, um, play it once again and then continue on okay so same thing one and two and three and four and two and go Sorry, I forgot to change the, the music. The only thing is it changes this guy, right? All right. So try to practice the, this piece like that very slowly. It's very repetitive, but the point is to get used to stopping and, uh, stopping and going with the bow, but in the same direction, right? So now let's try and play through the whole thing from the beginning to the, the end and let's try it slowly we'll play a couple of times and then we'll end the lesson by playing it with the accompaniment all right all right so let's just try playing it through the beginning till the end and let's just play it slowly okay try to remember all the things that we've talked about so um especially the bow the rhythm, I think you, you're getting used to all the, the dotted quarter rhythm, so I'm not too worried about it. So let's just try um, focus on the bow and also using your second finger, okay? All right, slowly. One and two and three and four. And ah. And stop. Da, da. 
ta ta. Heads up. And 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 stop. Ta ta. And pause. Break the bow. Not break the bow. <laughs> dun dun. Excellent. All right. Yeah, don't don't break the bow. <laughs> I meant put a break in the bowing. <laughs> okay, really good. Hopefully, um, you made it through with me. Uh, let's just try playing it once again. Uh, just a little bit faster, right? So, I'm counting out loud. I'm gonna try and switching it up to just um, kind of saying ta's in between the 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 dotted quarter notes. Okay. Um, because that's what the accompaniment is doing. So it goes like this. Chum, chum. Chum, chum. Like that. Matter of fact, you know, let's let's play at that speed, okay? So, dup, 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 bup, bup, bum, 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 bum. Like that. All right. Ready? One and two and three. And go. Cha cha. Chum chum. Cha cha. Chum and dum dum. Stop the bow. Stop the bow. Set the bow. Let's just try it a little bit faster for the last time together. Uh, hopefully, you're getting used to all the different movements. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna count this time. So try and feel the rhythm, the eighth notes. Try and feel the eighth notes all the time. Okay. So one and two and three. So we're gonna go slightly faster. Dun, dun. Almost, almost to the tempo of the the accompaniment. Okay. Bum 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 bum. All right. Ready? One and two and three and go. Jump jump. Dum dum. Dum, dum. 
There you go. All right, excellent. Now, let's play for the last time with the accompaniment this time. And we'll end the lesson with this, uh, this playthrough. All right, so it's pretty fast. Let's try and keep up, okay? Just think about all the things that we talked about. And yeah, let's, let's do it. Ready? So really good job. Uh, I hope this lesson uh, helped you out. Uh, just remember it's a guided practice. Uh, practice at your um, own speed. Um, how I'm doing it is very, very fast. Um, so if, if it's too fast for you, just play it at your own speed. Um, play it at the slower tempo that we worked on, right? Until you feel comfortable to, to play faster. So take your time. Um, as always, and if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment uh, on the video, okay? All right, happy practicing. Bye.